Admiral's Video Log. Earth Date 201909.03. This is WRL Podium 13. Greetings, fellow watchers. This is an unboxing video because I just recently purchased and picked up a new gaming PC. This is the iBuyPower Gaming Desktop. Now, I am not very savvy when it comes to certain things. I have a bit of mechanical inclination, so I can understand things pretty quickly, and I am a fast learner. So, this, I'm going to have to read this off of the box, because I don't know this by heart. This is the iBuyPower Gaming PC, Intel Core i7-8700K, 6-core, 3.7 gigahertz, 4.7 gigahertz turbo, NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2080, 8GB, I'm guessing that's the graphics card, yeah, that's the graphics card, 16GB DDR4, 2666 megahertz memory, 1TB SATA solid state drive, liquid cooling CPU, integrated Wi-Fi, Windows 10 Home Edition, 12 months premium warranty service, uh, lifetime technical <laughs> support. It's got a, uh, looks like what's including in here is a keyboard and a mouse. So unlike some of my other videos where I had already purchased and opened things, I have my trusty Tab 5 SE. Is that what this thing is called? The, let me see, it's called the Samsung Tab S5E. That's what it's called. I was going to read it off of here, but it's actually on the box instead. So I can put this to the side. As you can see, that's the Fanatec and the GT Track cockpit. Here are my trusty scissors that I use to unbox and open my boxes. And since this puppy is quite big, we can only see, we can only imagine what would happen if I were to take this and pick it up and put it on the desk. There's a good look at it from the front. And that's okay. And that's the side. Uh, it's apparently, let me see, what is that? That is a CSARC52. 552. 652? Sorry, I'm getting old, so my eyes are not very good. And these are not prescription glasses. Gaming keyboard, gaming mouse, power cord, owner's manual software disk. All right, I guess maybe another look at the other side here. Looks like it's, I saw it in the store. I picked it up at Best Buy today. It's got a glass side there, a glass, plexiglass, what do you want to call it? And that's where I was reading off all of the little details describing what this is. So let's get to the unboxing. I'm going to put this back on the floor, move the table to the side because that might be a bit pointless unless, of course, there's something I need to put on there. I might have been out of camera for a second, but I'm still new at this thing. As you can see, I now have a microphone, so I don't sound so far away. I guess I'm just trying to figure out how to position that so I don't get clogged up in the fray of the unboxing. All right. Come to this side. All right, we got the top side opened. Now let's see what is in here. We have a thank you for purchasing an iBuyPower PC. Never heard of iBuyPower before, it's brand new to me, but I did some reviews. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, let me see, I think I can open it up and look really quick. There were, there is another model, um, there's another model, I think it's the BB953, if I were to go back, I can find it, it, let me see here, let me see if I can find it, because I was looking at another model, 
I think it had a different graphics card, so I will have to put that graphics card, select that graphics card. There it is. That's the one right there. This is the, yeah, this one had the NVIDIA RTX 2070, 207. The model number is BB953952 for the one that I was looking at. This is the BB953, and the BB952 had the 2070 or the 20 the 2070 NVIDIA, NVIDIA RTX graphic, graphics card. I have the 2080 graphics card, and um, I did some research and reading on it, and apparently the people who purchased it were very happy with it, so I decided to get one. Um, we, a matter of fact, I'll come over to the camera real quick and show you that this particular model is the one that I was looking at. It had 1,131 views, and they're almost all five-star views. That is the one that I was looking at. This is the one that I purchased, and it had 706 reviews, almost all five stars. So I read a few of them, and I was happy with what they said. So I decided to go ahead and get the uh, 2080. And that is what we have here. So that's why I made that decision. As far as trying to build PCs, I have no idea how to do that. Of course I could learn, but that's not something I haven't done yet. But this is just a basic quick guide saying thank you for purchasing. Yeah, it's a quick start guide. Pretty much telling you everything that you need to do in there. All right. How do I pull this out of here? Okay, what we have here, I'm guessing, yes. That is the Aris E1 gaming keyboard. Hope you can see that there. Looks pretty nice. I guess I will be probably using this, but I don't know yet. I'm looking forward to using this for iRacing. I'll put this over here. And what do we have any other things on the side there? All right, I guess now the only thing is to get in here and pull this baby out. We want to do it like that? No. What is the best way to do this? I think the best way to do this is to take it, slide it, tilt it here, pull it over since it's in a styrofoam. And then I hope you can still see that. Pull the microphone cord over to the side and lift. Uh oh, it's stuck on something. Uh oh, it's stuck on something. I wonder what it. Oh, I think I know what it is. Let's get in there and ah, that's what it's stuck on. Oh, maybe just bend it down. And I think that's what it was. Let's, let's try that again. Yeah, that's what it was stuck on. All right, pull the box off. Put that in the back. All right, what we have here, we have the Zeus E2 gaming mouse. Hmm, all right, put that right there. And we also have, I'm guessing this is the power cord. Yep, that's the power cord. And some other paraphernalia inside of there. Okay, some nice little Ziploc bag here. What do we have? Free gift, follow instructions on other side. One of your free gifts, two weeks estimated delivery. Hmm, interesting. There's a picture of what looks like maybe a mouse pad and some headphones. I wonder what that free gift will be. I guess I'll have to find out. We'll put that card there. Let's get in here. Here are, I'm guessing, okay, MSI graphics card hmm quick users guide msi is ms for those of you who may be watching which i'm guessing just because i'm so new at this i don't have a lot of watchers or viewers if anybody is happen to be watching or just happen to pass by this video and see this unboxing is msi graphics card associated with nvidia or is that something else i don't know I'm not very computer savvy. I just try to do some reading and to make a decision from there. And we've got what looks like some sort of, I have no idea what that is. It looks like, whoa. 
almost look like it reminds me of a piece that comes on the back of one of my center channel speakers that acts as a lift guide, if you will, to so that you can angle the, 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 the speaker up and you can use this with a brace attached to it to angle it up if you wanted to use that function. But this bends at the edge. I guess I'll have to find out. Is that a microphone? I wonder if that's a microphone because it almost looks like a microphone. I don't know what that is. I guess I will find out later. And of course you got the power cord. So wait a minute, there's something else in here. It looks like it's another one of those antenna-like type things. There's two of these in here. They almost look like microphones, but there's nothing that looks like it would attach to anything. I guess I'll find out later what those are. For the time being, I'll put that microphone-looking antenna brace type thing in there. Power cord will go back in. I was just doing an unboxing. I will put the MSI graphics card quick guide back inside. I'll put that back inside and zip that back closed. Lay that there. And then now I will tilt this to the side like that so. And I will pull that styrofoam off. And then what will be the next step? I think maybe I will tilt it this way use this piece of styrofoam as a brace to sit it on top of there. It's not very heavy, but that styrofoam is also not very stable either. I just lay that on top of that, but it was just a temporary measure. See, it's very light. It's not very heavy at all. And I could set, sit those two to the side. I can pull, look, put that on my lap right there so I can pull the, the plastic cover off, put that, lay that there, and wow, I guess I'm going to have to go inside this thing because there's a very large bag on the inside of this computer. I can't remember the last time I've owned a desktop, and this is it. I will take it and bring it close so maybe you can take a look. There's a bag inside there. All right. I think now what I would like to do is set it down here. Oh, get that off the mic cord. All right. And I will take the keyboard, the mouse, set that over here. I will also take the quick guide, set that here. And then I will take table, put it there, and I will take the laptop, I mean not the laptop, the desktop, and put that there, and that is the front, has, when I saw it in the store, when I saw it in the store, had blue lighting here, maybe it will be some different lighting that will light up, it's a very basic front, nothing too fancy, if you will, and uh, of course, there is the back side where you have where you do all your little connections. Use video ports below for display. Huh. Remove this sticker before use. I will do that when I go through the process of hooking this up and putting it in in the front with the home theater. For the time being, it is going to be hooked up to the home theater and replace the laptop. Now, we've got a side view. And I just rolled over my microphone cord. Let me get that untangled. All right. Maybe one of these days I can get a different type of mic without a cord. But for the moment, here we are. Please read before turning on your system. Instructions for removing phone packaging from inside the system. Huh. Opening the case number one. Number two, removing the side panel. Number three, removing the phone packaging. So maybe that's all that is, just phone packaging. I don't know. I will find out when I open it. But that is the new iBuy... I'm sorry. Yes, yes. The iBuyPower gaming desktop that I just purchased. 
looking forward to playing computer racing games now along with Gran Turismo. Um, I play Gran Turismo on the PlayStation 4 Pro and I have Project Cars 1 and 2 and I also have F1 2019. I'm going to be looking forward to using this to do my console game capturing that I'll run through here and making videos to show when I do racing online and I will also be looking forward to using this for iRacing. Apparently there's a new video game that I just became aware of called Automobilista 2. I think that's how you pronounce that. That's what I'll be looking forward to trying out also, but definitely looking forward to iRacing. I may even go so far as to get to uh, move this out of my home theater and into the front where I have another system there that I could use, which I actually had envisioned using as my gaming place where I can go and possibly even get myself the three monitors or if I decide, go with the, um, the VR version of it. I will probably try them all out and see how they work. And, but this is the unboxing and that's the finishing of the unboxing and that's what I'll be looking forward to hooking this up and trying it out with. So this is WRL Podium 13, finishing the unboxing of the iPower, iBuyPower Gaming PC. And if I sound a little strange, it's because this is just the voice I have chosen to use to talk like this. It's weird, I know, but it's what it is. So y'all have a good day. Now you hear WRL Podium 13 shining off. Good day now. End transmission.